Chilling video captured by a New Yorker reporter circulating online shows a complicated mix of preparation and spontaneous violence during a riot at the U.S. Capitol on January 6, political violence expert Robert Pape said Sunday. Luke Mogelson, a veteran war correspondent and contributing writer for the outlet, followed rioters inside the building and documented the chaos. The insurrection was triggered by supporters of President Donald Trump who believe his false claim that he won the election. Trump spoke at a rally earlier in the day and encouraged his followers to flock to the Capitol. The video captures rioters hunting for lawmakers and, finding none, photographing documents as evidence, said Pape, a political scientist at the University of Chicago and director of the Chicago Project on Security and Threats. Pape said some individuals, particularly those giving orders, may have had military, law enforcement or, quasi-paramilitary, training. He specifically pointed to a man carrying zip ties and wearing military fatigues, later identified as Larry Rendell Brock Jr., a retired Air Force lieutenant colonel, who appeared to be giving commands to other rioters in the video. Brock Jr. was later arrested and charged with knowingly entering or remaining in a restricted building without lawful authority and violent entry and disorderly conduct on Capitol grounds, according to The New Yorker. There seems to be some members of the rioters who are more prepared, and others who seem to be responding in a more spontaneous way and taking orders from those who are more prepared, he said. Mogelson said the crowd did not seem to have a plan beyond finding lawmakers and had they been successful bloodshed was possible. I did not see anything inside the Capitol that would conclusively indicate some kind of overarching, orchestrated plan, he said. I mostly saw the opposite. In the footage, the crowd is seen pushing past police officers, some in riot gear, and entering the Capitol through a shattered window. Mogelson said rioters outside the building were, extremely violent and extremely hostile, toward police, but once they breached the building they were much friendlier. Inside, the large group can be seen confronting several Capitol Police officers and demanding to be let through. You're outnumbered, one man said. We are listening to Trump, your boss. The crowd moves up a set of stairs chanting, treason, and roams the hallways banging on doors. The footage then shows a group entering the empty Senate chambers, demanding to know where the lawmakers including House Speaker Nancy Pelosi are. Some in the crowd seemed to be threatening Pelosi, and Mogelson reported that the crowd chanted, Hang Mike Pence, in reference to the vice president. Some people began taking photos of documents and one man said he was trying to find something that he could use against these scumbags. The group finds papers related to Sen.